Road Road Series and this game tonight, but also one of the most unique plays that's ever happened in professional baseball. For the details, here's Tim Kirchner. Thank you, uh, Dan. 30 years ago on this field, a backup catcher named Dave Bresnahan brought new meaning to the hidden ball trick. He took a potato, he peeled it, he painted some red stitching on it, and he put it in a catcher's mitt and put it on the bench. Then he pretended that his catcher's mitt had broken during the game. He ran to the bench, got the new catcher's mitt with the potato in it. He put it in his right hand, put it behind his back, and with a runner at second base, he said, I'm gonna, third base, I'm gonna pick this guy off. So he throws the potato to third. He hits the runner, the, the potato kind of bursts into three pieces. But the runner, of course, doesn't know this, so he runs home, and there, Dave Bresnahan tagged him out at the plate. So, eventually, the umpires figured out what the heck was going on here. They gave the guy home plate, of course. Bresnahan was taken out of the game immediately by his manager, Orlando Gomez. He was fined $50, and the next day, he got released. But a year later, they retired his number in this ballpark. They sold out the ballpark, and all they charged to get in was $1 as long as you brought a potato. <laughs> <laughs> and his number is actually still up on the outfield wall here at this ballpark, but it's covered up now by the Little League logos that are just here for tonight. But if you come to a cross-cutters game, you'll see, I believe it's number 59 is Bresnahan's number, and he is, of course, the originator of the the great potato caper. I love the detail that. that goes into it, that he spent the time making sure the stitching, all of the things to make sure this potato looked just like a baseball. When I was hearing this story told, I'm thinking, there's no way this happened in 1987. This is like a story from 1907, right. like that, that, that's grown in legend, but this is a fairly modern story. I'm like, there's no way that flu did it, and sure enough. He got canned the next day. Do you think he ran it by anybody before he did it, or do you think that he just kept it to himself and said, I think he had a couple, oh, couple buddies on the team yeah. in on the, right the third baseman in on things. Potato. Great potato game.